Well, hello, hello, all my amazingly beautiful Leo friends. My name is Libra Empress, and we're going to be discussing your tarot for today. Now, remember that this is a general reading, and this is for yours as well as for my entertainment. And also, please don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and share. That way, you'll always be up to date with the content that I produce, and you'll be a part of our family, all right? All right. Now, I already pre-shuffled because I wanted to save time, and my, my gosh, it takes forever. So, um, I got it separate. I got your... Oh my gosh, I can't even speak straight. I must have been done doing this all night, huh? Whew, okay, so here's the deal. I got your pile shuffled into three piles. Past, present, future. Like yesterday and the day before and the day before that, okay? Now, each pile has clarifier cards. I usually do three clarifier cards per pile. Sometimes you get more, sometimes you don't. Sometimes you just get the regular. Either way, you know... It's all there. Now, it might resonate. It might not resonate. And remember, when we get to the future, it is not set in stone. And it, it is very fluid. And we all have a choice, all right? So you can choose to go that way if it is your future. Or you can choose to overcome it. Whichever way, all right? Now, let's get going, shall we? Now, my beautiful, beautiful Leos, your past energy is the Ace of Cups kind of a little bit stuck in your head, huh? Just a little bit. It's okay. We all get that way. I mean, you're having fun with family and friends. Just having a hell of a good time. And somehow somebody says something that they regret. Or you you or them said something, right? And you didn't remember to, to think about what you're going to say and how you're going to say it to who you're going to say it. So you cut off someone from from your you cut someone off from you but ultimately it actually hurt both of you because when you need them now there's nothing there bridges were burned cut down you know how it goes but ultimately this is my favorite card out of the whole deck i don't i think it's because of the high five <laughs> in my story it says you get a high five card anyway someone's going to help you with something and it might not be that same person it might be a different person your current energy is the nine swords. You're, you're a warrior. You're not caring about nobody's bullshit. You're gonna trudge through and handle your shit the way you need to get it handled, whether you hurt anybody or not. Now, this could be you, or this could be someone in your current energy. All right. I just feel like it. It's one or the other. And what's funny about that is that. You've got this guy here, the, the Knight of Cups. I always think he's a player because he wants to steal your heart. <laughs> and maybe you're fighting with him. Okay, he goes with a surf. He's in and out like a little player. You're waiting on information regarding him or a certain situation. Okay, you're learning. You're getting advice. You're educating yourself. And ultimately, you're going to be calling judgment because you're not going to put up with this shit no more and you're going to have to claim your judgment okay which when i mean that is that um, acknowledge that you're acknowledge your role in the judgment okay of what happened take responsibility that's not to say you were in the wrong i'm just saying that it's like this okay my if if i was in a relationship that ended I'd have to reflect and think about what I did wrong in my relationship. I know that they did shit wrong, okay? But it's not all their fault because when we were in it together, it was a half equal, okay? They caused bullshit and I caused bullshit. So when we separated, I can't put all the blame on their shoulders. I can't, I can't do that. That's irresponsible. It's not logical. Even if they cheated, what caused them to cheat? What did, what could I have done to prevent them from cheating? Was it because they were an asshole? And they were just going to want to cheat? Or was it because I was working on something else and too busy to be able to... Did I say that I had a headache too many times and then they kind of wandered off? Got that sandwich and free sex from someone else because I wasn't paying attention to their needs? Or was I giving them too much needs and they thought that they had it all so they wanted to cheat anyway? You see what I'm saying? Yeah, a big majority of half of it was their responsibility, their bullshit, they're human, they make mistakes, but so was I, and I made mistakes, and we could have worked together to build something stronger, but we didn't, so we split. That's not a real scenario, I'm just saying that, that is a, that's a, an example, okay? 
Now, my beautiful Leos, your future is the your will of destiny, right? Will of fortune. You are following through with your wish fulfillment. Everything's coming together. All right, you are pulling strength. You are so strong, Leo. So strong. Mentally, physically, emotionally. You're able to be there. You're, you're that person that everybody leans on when they need help. The venting machine. Not vending, unless you have, like, soda coming out of your cooch. That's not what I'm saying. Venting. So when someone comes to you, they're venting. Although, <laughs> it would be a good pun to have a vending, be a vending machine, huh? They give me money, I give them sodas. I was supposed to smack my lips. You're dealing with an air sign. Maybe you're listening to me. Maybe that's what it is. No, I'm just kidding. This is an air sign. This is a Libra. Right? You're a magician, maybe? You're dealing with someone who's who's an air sign. Anyway, you're able to make miracles happen. You're a magician. You'll be able, you're able to ask the Lord for help or whoever you pray to. And they give you blessings to be able to grow, you know, flowers or just like to better the earth in one way or your situation. You're just, you're very blessed. And last but not least is you've got another Leo or this is you, right? You're going off into the sunset. You're enjoying yourself. Everything's all handy dandy. You've handled the situation and everything's coming up roses. You know, you're, you're accomplishing goals, you know, that's awesome. All right, I love you Leos. You're gonna have a great day today. Thank you so much for letting me read for you. Please don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and share. And join me again for tomorrow's Daily Horoscope or next time's Date Tarot, all right? I love you. Let me know how it went. You know, how you're doing in the comments. <laughs> Bye, babies.